Hello everybody, Jet here, and welcome back to my Space Hulk Tactics playthrough as the Blood Angels, where we are working our way to the third detonation mission. Now, we're stuck in this massive morass of stuff, and we've got to go through a mission first, so... Um... You know, I want to get through this, so I'm actually going to leave one guy behind. It's just one of my normal brothers, so I'm going to leave him behind to clear things up. Well, now, what's this? Brother Sergeant, we found an ancient energy core connected to an Eldari portal. We must power up the court core to activate the portal. Acknowledged. And so now we need to go back this way. I wanted to get through there, but I can't get through that door. Oh. Oh yeah, we've, we've set off more. We're going to inevitably set off all of these guys. I'm not even going to try and avoid it. Um, I'm going to leave him as well for now. Because I want to get through. I am going to have to fight some of them. Let's have a look at my squad who I've got left at the moment. I have pressed the squad management button. It was just taking a while to load. So we've lost two of those. We've got one left. What does he have? Um, let's get both of these, actually, because they are much better. Um, and we can afford to potentially drop one of these guys. Um, I say that Lazaro is much better. Um, and we do, of course, want a full squad when we get there. It seems the orc crew, crew tried to keep their fungus food supply safe by sealing off whole sections of a vessel. And yet still, they eventually perished. So this is all the remains of one big orc vessel attached onto this space hulk. And we've set off more... Ooh. Ah, I should have gone that way first. Oh, well, let's do this. I want to get everything here, guys. So, uh, let's see which one it offers this time. But we're not leaving my apothecary. So, uh, bless your weapons for the Emperor. Awaken and extract two Terminators. That doesn't sound too bad, he says. I might regret saying that. I am sorry, guys, by the way, if I sound a bit more husky than usual, I am full of cold. Um, I'm also absolutely really tired at the moment because my uh, son was up until... He is also full of cold and was screaming all of last night, so I'm also quite tired and I'm muting myself a lot to cough. So I know I do say that a lot, but I really am today, so I do apologise if there's an unusual pause or silence or you might even hear the odd cough on this stream, and I really do apologise for that. Um... So we do have some sleeping brothers out here. Oh, it's the sergeant who's already asleep. Ooh, and we've got some dead guys as well. Um. Oh, wow, I messed up the squad I was bringing. Oh, well, never mind. I guess we get to use the flamer. Now, one thing I have learned from some of these comments, and thank you very much for that, is uh, with the auto cannon after a reload, you have a chance of it exploding if it's fired in the next turn, which is what happened to me last time, guys. Um, well, the extraction points are up here, so we want to make sure this route is covered. Um, we're going to send him round the corner to start blowing the doors apart, and we'll use the flamer to really cover that. Uh, one, two, one, two, three, four, five. So we're relatively safe that way. Where did they actually spawn? Here. Both spawned there, so we're very safe over this way. And let's just get everybody moving forwards at full speed now, because we're safe for now. Let's just have a look at these. So that unlocks and locks that door. 
Um, we want to make sure we're all set up before that, before we even look at going into there. So, all fallen terminators, there's only one. Okay, that'll do. I must have misread it. I thought it said two terminators to start with. So, what we're going to do, guys, we're going to leave our flamer back here to cover this entrance. Um, while we move. And we'll start moving up this way with my heavy to cover as we go in. And obviously, we'll use everybody as we move. Uh, but basically, we're just going to keep the uh, lines of fire. We're just going to try and keep all of the, the various arcs nice and clear. So that we can advance without too much hostility. I mean, obviously, at some point, we are going to have to push through here. Why do I not have my librarian? Remind me to actually look at who I'm taking next time. Because my librarian would be incredibly useful here. Yeah, we've got plenty of space here if they push through. Mm. I'm doing that to give myself some extra points so I can flame here and can get all my other brothers moving better. Let's flame here and we'll get one of those blips. That is just a corpse. Taking up position. I should have kept him facing that way. Not that they're going to be able to get through there. I shouldn't have ever shot that door open. I could have locked it, actually. Hmm. They may push down here, but it's risky for them if they do, and I kind of want them to, because that would actually put them at a bigger risk. I only need to get two Terminators out here, but I do need to get the bot, the uh, get awaken the other guy. So, but he doesn't necessarily need to be the one who escapes. That's fine. I can take him easily enough next turn. I will say you are unlikely to uh, get. Um, because you've got to roll three of the same to blow up. So it's unlikely to happen, but it is still a risk. Nothing. I regret everything there. That was really bloody stupid of me. They melee him. He survives. I'm going to flame there, then I'm going to start falling back this way. I think I may have messed up here, though. Nice! Because we were guaranteed a success there, and now the next guy has to move for us to be able to do anything, so... What? What? I definitely put him on Overwatch. Did going in melee break the Overwatch? Not that they attacked me, thank God. For some reason, they could have easily killed me there, so I am... I got very lucky there. What's this card do? Ooh, that's nice for us. I don't want to be burning that off. Yes, 
We're overwatching with these two guys. Open that door. One, two, three, four, five, six. Thing is, if they're right next to me, I can't flame. One, two, three, four, five, six. If that's a two of though. I mean, who else would I be using it on? So these flames will now last two turns, which will give us longer to escape. Mm. Pushing forwards here is going to be the tricky bit. We do only need to get one guy through. Oh, perfect. Actually, I'm, I'm better to have them attacking. Because this way, they're burning themselves off, and it's going to give me if, it's going to give me the ability to get in there. Especially with this car, which, which will give me four extra moves. Oh, damn. to reload but actually I probably shouldn't have done that this turn you know what yes, I'm going to do something different oh what I thought I'd be able to shoot. What? I thought I could just shoot the ground. Oh, it costs two. Two, three, four, five, six. So we're relatively safe there. That said, you can pull up and overwatch that way. I meant to do that. Honest, I, I didn't think I was pressing overwatch when I shot the door. look daft what I'm doing here guys but I'm trying to get him close so that he can just maneuver around that corner next turn and flame the next group Next turn, I'm just going to take my flame around and flame them and get somebody down here on Overwatch so we can start pushing forwards here. I really should have probably got my heavy in position, but this will this will work. Hmm. 
Again, I'm regretting blowing some of these doors open because I could have locked them. Oh god, that's more than I wanted. Me luck. That's a multiple stack. I'm in trouble. Ooh, thank God. Turn. How long do I keep that for, the negative? Or is that just permanently now I've reloaded? We're going to move back. I know they're going to come, come up to us, but... I'm relatively safe now. We need to push next turn. I've put him back because he's out of ammo. Um, we're going to have to push with these guys next turn. We may not make this, but it's not a massively... You know, it's only a side mission, so losing is not the end of the world. To be fair, I could get away with losing them all here and we'd still win, weirdly. Pushing through here is going to be hard, and that's where I may wish I had a heavy forward. But I'm going to reset my flamer, so if my forward guy does go down, I'll be able to flame up there. I have to say, why can't I see those guys in front of me? Refill the flamer. Damn, I should have locked that door behind us. Flame's gonna move forwards to try and charge in here and get the sergeant as we push. give that guy a little bit of a buff if they do end up in melee with us, which is a good chance with how much is there. Come on, Heavy. Oh, God. This is very possibly over now, guys, because, uh, Ugh. I hate the way they can run out of your line of sight like that, guys. We're down to two two guys. One more guy goes down before, you know, I mean, theoretically, yeah, we could do this, but it's very unlikely now. I'm finding some of these hard side missions harder than the actual main missions. Um...
I can do that, can't I? Yes. One's nothing. <sighs> if I run there, I'm going to get attacked by something from one of them. God, this is this is gonna be close. I mean, the amount of dead gene stealers there. for us. Come on! I've crashed. The game has crashed and will. One thing to do, guys, and what I am doing here is I'm actually going to upload this for a very specific reason, guys. Um, I, this is weird. The game I've had a fatal error, but it's definitely crashed. So it's not going to do anything else. But what I'm going to do, guys, and this is actually actually a, a key thing. I've I've worked in the games industry myself as a tester. So, if you do get something like this in the game, when you get the uh, pop-up, which, hang on, let's swap over to my other screen, here, hello, you can see me now, so, we will fill this in, so, crash on mission, as much detail, actually, this is a really good thing, so put as much detail in here as you possibly can, so I'm actually going to leave this up in the background, but for example here, if we wanted to do it full QA-wise, you'd go one, Launch. Oh, you can see my screen here. Um, so let's do one. Uh, yeah, launch. Space Hulk. Tactics. Two load game. Dung, 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 dung. But what I will do put is crash on mission X. Please see video, and I'll link to this video once I've uploaded it, guys. As always, thank you very much for watching. I do hope you have enjoyed this. I do apologise for the crash, but I've left that there just as a little, uh, as a little teaching thing. Because having done the job, I, I, I know how frustrating it is when you get a random crash report, especially if it's something which happens regularly, and none of the crash reports which actually tell you anything. So it's a very useful thing for you guys to be able to do. Thank you very much for your time, guys, and I'll start my next one hopefully past that mission.